Good evening. It's Bourbon Night. Hello, I'm Chad. I'm Sarah. Welcome in. It's my birthday. It's Chad's birthday. <laughs> Thank you for joining us to celebrate. Yes, I'm going to get a little mystery pour going for us. This Sounds is good. from our friend Matt Preston. Thank you, Matt Preston. I just texted so him and asked if he would text me what this is in about five minutes. So hopefully oh, he has seen that text. Oh, otherwise we're just having a mystery pour. And is uh, willing to oblige. Um, but yeah, welcome in everybody. This is going to be just kind of a, you know, what they call on them internets an AMA. Oh yeah. And ask me anything except it's an ask us anything. Mm -hmm. And, um. Looks like you're getting a spam call. Oh no, that's probably no. from. Yeah. Oh, I'm just going to have to ignore that then because that's <laughs> going to drive me nuts. Yeah. Um, that's just our uh, Google number buzzing. Right. So. Right. Yeah, so. We're just going to keep an eye on the chat. We have some voicemails that we're going to play. There might be some questions in there. If so, we'll answer them. Mm -hmm. uh, otherwise, we'll just kind of It's Chad's birthday. We're doing what Chad wants. to it. Yeah. And I brought up some of my favorite things. And but I, <laughs> I like that. <laughs> but I didn't get too crazy. Some things are crazy, but really it's just what I like to drink. In fact, I meant to go in the cabinet there and I and I forgot. Not that we don't have enough things behind us, but I wanted to kind of mix it up and, you know, do some fancy high proof things and some just some not fancy things yeah. and Yeah, exactly. Just a range. Let's try this mystery pour. Okay. I saw that he texted me, but I don't want to look at it. He said say when. Oh, he did? Yeah. Okay. I can only know that because it popped up on the computer. I'm not a creeper like creeper. that. Creeper. Well, oh, I, well, I, I like that probably knows smell. It first. Um, I like that smell. Someone said, and I didn't see who commented that, sorry. Someone said that I'll tell you what it is just by nosing it. I'm like, oh, I w if only. <laughs> but that would also take some fun out of things. Right. Got a few super chats we'll get to you in just one Ooh. second. It's... Is it a little nutty, Sarah? You know, Chad, I'm regretting putting on lip gloss before this because oh, it smells no. like coconuts. <laughs> Everything smells like coconuts. When will I learn? <laughs> oh, well, I don't know. Uh, mm, I'm getting kind of like a maybe Heaven Hill, a maybe Buffalo Trace. I'm getting a Buffalo Trace vibe. You're getting That's that Buffalo Trace say. vibe? Yeah. Through the co that might be the coconut. Matt is a big Buffalo Trace fan. Let's see. Buffalo Trace? Did I really just say it that way? Buffalo. Yeah, put, put more syllables in there. Buffalo Trace. Buffalo. What's that commercial? You look amazingly comfortable. comfortable. <laughs> you always How say, but it's about the t-shirt. many syllables? How many times? Woo! That's higher. Ha <sighs> ha! That is higher. Then it no. Whoa. Silky. <laughs> Chad's birth. We'll call it Chad's birthday surprise. <laughs> I turned into Polly Shore for a second. Yes, you did. Silky. <laughs> you get through that cough. Uh, you keep tasting and thinking about whatever's going on over there. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Sa Sachin? Kane? I'm so, I'm so sorry that I don't know how to pronounce your name. Apo seriously apologies uh he says love you guys and thank you for that super chat uh, two, two pounds probably pounds don't embarrass us okay. <laughs> I <don't know. laughs> no idea. um jeff winbush says happy birthday chad party like a bourbon star <laughs> <laughs> nice. party like a bourbon star but old, old song oh yeah. i know yeah. it jg says chad and sarah thank you my wait thank you my bourbon probably bourbon friends uh happy birthday chad now let's hear that jingle. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he requested it. Um, Comes with a super I, I can't think of anything to substitute when you have a structured annuity that relates when to bourbon. When you have a... St structured pour no. and you need mash now called J.G. Wentworth. 877 mash now. <laughs> Sorry, that wasn't, that wasn't right. Andrew says, happy birthday, Chad. What's the lineup for tonight? So we were just kind of talking about that. Uh, we're just kind of going to wing it. Um, it's wing it. Chad's birthday. He can pour whatever he wants. <clears throat> right now we're drinking a mystery pour. Uh, we got a few of our favorite things behind us. You can pretty much bet on that there's going to be a booker, so let's be real. Um, yeah, we'll see where the night takes us. Yeah. So maybe just drink your favorite things along with Chad, and that will make him happy for his birthday. Very, very happy. All right, I'm going to go ahead and text... Matt, uh, uh, and say now, please. 
Now I'm wondering if it's something. How mm. high do the Willett family estates go? How high in proof? Oh, I could not tell you, but they do get up there. Oh, it's so silky. I could see it being like one of the older ones. Potentially. I, I'm not getting the Buffalo Trace vibe on the taste, on the are taste. you? I'm getting uh, more of a Heaven Hill. I don't think it's Four Roses. If I had to guess, I'd say it was some Willett family estate. That's what I would say. That's a triangle. Oh. Cheers for Michelle Martin. Thank you. <clears throat> oh, thank you, happy Michelle. Birthday, Chad. Cheers. Uh, and cheers to everyone else uh, who, who has super chatted. Uh, yes. And Jean, Le De Jean de la Cuisine. I love that. <laughs> Happy birthday, Chad. You fine specimen of a man. Well, cheers. He's not going to say no to it. Hello. Huh. Well, we might be right um, because it is, it's Kentucky Owl. Uh, batch, oh. batch nine. Oh, I was way off. So What's the proof on that? What's the age? Well, do they... 127.6 Yeah, that's proof. up there. That was hot for the first one. I was like, I wasn't ready. <laughs> yeah, wow, that's good. Thank you, Matt. Batch 9, Kentucky Owl. Woo! That's some hot stuff. I'm going to save the rest of that. You have some things, you have some an agenda <clears throat> for us? I do, so there's... there's. Should we get something else going? There, there's Yeah, we should. Um, I want to drink... Chad wants to drink. What we have left of green oh. from Don Nishida. Uh, Thank if, you again, Don. Yes. Um, Check. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you to Don. Thank you to Clifton for inviting us on his channel. Um, if you guys weren't there for the live, you can go and check out his channel. He just rebranded. He's rebranding, so I don't think you can just say it's YouTube.com slash. Yeah, you just I think Bourbon it, Bites, but it wouldn't be that. It I wouldn't be know. that yet? It might be. I it don't know. It might be. I don't know. I haven't seen who we have moderator-wise uh, in tonight, but Help. if you could link to Clifton's channel, please. We would or greatly Clifton, appreciate it. If you're here, I don't I know if it, if it flags him. links if you're not a moderator. But anyway, you should go check out that live stream. It was with us and Perry and Matt from Whiskey Crusaders and it was Clifton, a lot of, fun. of course. And uh, we were all drinking Don Nishida uh, Mystery Pours of Five, and this is the one that I picked first and it is of course a wild turkey 101 of course you picked a second i did uh it's from 19 19 and 92 what which, did i pick first and i picked orange first you picked 1993 wild turkey yes, i picked the right. older turkey clifton and perry i can't remember if matt yeah i think matt picked it and you picked the 93 turkey i picked the older and let's just say better 1992 is that how it works yeah so we should age bourbon for 40 years then yeah. No, there wouldn't be anything no, left. It would taste, left. and it would that'd taste be, like dirt. That'd be awful. It'd be terrible. But yeah, thank you again, Don, for the care package. We yeah. already, uh, you know, nommed on those. And I still got a little left on those treats and Drake called the. So get get yourself whiskey. a wild turkey 101. This is a an eight year mm. age stated export from 1992 Austin Nichols wild turkey. Oh, there's just something about older turkey. Mm, Come on, mm, mm, forget about mm, it. Mm, forget mm, about mm, it. Mm. <laughs> All right. Um, we want to thank a patron, uh, Derek. What's how's that? I would say Julian. Julian. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Derek. Oh, not thank you. We want to say happy birthday. Yeah. It's your birthday. <laughs> well, thank you for being for a being... patron, of course. Yeah. Um, but it's all, we share the same birthday, and he messaged and he let us know that. So you know, we want to give birthday credit where birthday credits due, and say yep. happy birthday, Derek. You know who else's birthday it is today? Mark from uh, the Bourbon, the Bourbon Life. Life. Yeah. Yeah. We were on his podcast. It came out. Like a week ago or so. I think it was a f not this past uh, Friday, but the Friday before. Yeah, yeah, a couple weeks, and uh, we share the same birthday. So if you follow him Weird. on Instagram, make sure you wish him a happy birthday as well. Yes. All right, we got some super chats. James Wolverton, thank James. you, sir. Happy birthday, Chad. Check out Castle and Key. Greer also <laughs> says happy birthday. A bottle flip, like uh, like like With the glass. <laughs> no, I don't know about that. Neither of us are super coordinated. <laughs> Uh, Chad can argue that if he would like, I fully admit. Unless we're talking about ping pong. Mm, yeah. Ping pong is like the only time my reflexes are even somewhat decent. And mine uh, are... Pretty, whatever. Pretty, pretty dang good. All right. Well, I think you're getting rusty. You mm -hmm. better mm -hmm. watch that talk in your older years. Yes, you're right. <laughs> mm. John Wadsworth says, happy birthday, Chad. Also, thank you to my wonderful wife, Melissa. Friday was our 16th anniversary. Wow. Yeah. 16 years? I'm sorry. I'm just having a hard time believing that you weren't like 
12, 16 <laughs> years ago. Could have been. I don't know. Uh, anyways, um, mm. quite amazing that she's put up with me for so long. Right? Uh, <laughs> A lot to celebrate this month. Yeah, definitely. Thank you. <clears throat> uh, and then we've got, who did I skip? Joseph Brazo says, I'm just here for the cake. <laughs> I did make a fully from scratch uh, German chocolate cake, which I decided afterwards could have used some bourbon in it, but I didn't want to experiment with Chad's birthday cake, so. Hey, speaking of Joseph. Oh yeah, Joseph. We got uh, a hound here whose name is Proof. He's a Proof hound. He's a Proof hound, so thank you. Isn't uh, that cute? Thank you, Joseph. Thank you, Joseph. This is awesome. And I the, think- we've, we've had to convince Zoe that she doesn't want it. Yeah. I she's she's, okay. she's over it now. It's like, ah, oh, that toy's too big for me. Mm. <laughs> it's like half her size. Hey, okay, so Bourbon Bites. There's Clifton. Clifton. Okay, yeah, we were talking about your channel. I'm here, and new channel is live. Thank you guys for being on. Cheers, and happy birthday, Chad. Thank you much. Uh, so, I don't know if anyone can... I don't know, Clifton, if you can link or if it'll flag you. I don't know who we have... I don't want you to get flagged. ...here, moderator-wise. But they, they can hit allow. Sure. But, uh, yeah, we want to make sure people um, know about your channel there, yeah. Clifton, and can watch, watch us on watch us on there. Go watch. But not right now. No, but, like, in, in like, 35, Yeah, I mean, minutes. like, finish this yeah, first. Or two, two screen it. Right. Whatever you want to do. <laughs> and JG says, type of before, Chad and Sarah, thank you, my bourbon whisperers. Aha! Um, happy birthday again. Whiskey cheers. Well, thank you, JG. Cheers for all those. And Jake Miller says, the real puppy fund continues. Hmm. Yes, jo I wonder if Joseph was like doing the puppy fund and then also proof hound. Uh, it'll have to work for now. <laughs> it'll Thank you. it'll soothe me for now. There it is. There's uh, Trev with the link to uh, Thank you, Trev. the video that we were on with uh, over on Clifton's channel. So. I have been showing Chad a lot of pictures of dogs though. That's what? true. I'll slowly wear him down. Mm. Mm. I mean, um, it would be wrong to take the super chats that were for the puppy fund and not put them in the puppy fund. Right. Yes. Thank you for making it a legitimate cost. <laughs> so, hold on. Sorry, I, I finished my drink. I should probably have something on hand before we get into this you next should, part. You should. You should. Let's see. Check, <laughs> check, check. Making sure we cover all of our bases. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have a hard time believing this or not, but this is my work life too. I just I'm like, let me mark this off the list and mark that off the list. I think a nice Knob Creek, a oh, mash made in heaven. Oh, uh, okay. Very, very low here on this bottle, but I feel like this will be a great little pour mm -hmm. for us here. Oh, and there's Perry. Perry's in the chat. Pear bear. Whoop. That's good. Okay. Thank you. Someone's got to drive. It's your birthday. That's right. <laughs> and by drive, I mean lead the show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, um... What else did you get for your birthday? Well... We got some gifts. We got some things. Yeah, you're talking about... I'm talking about talking these about things. This? I'm talking about any of the things you want to talk about. Yeah, okay. So, if you guys didn't tune in to last week's live, go back and watch it. It's pretty monumentous. Um, there was some conspiring going on. Um, Some good sorting. Yes. Uh, led by Andrew Woodrew. Woodrew Bolin. Yes. Uh, another <laughs> one of our amazing patrons. He got together. Uh, I heard that he and, and Trev Wilson. They plotted. We're doing some ring a ding ding uh, talking. Um, also, uh, <laughs> Todd. -a -ding -ding. <laughs> you know, phones used to do that. Ring a ding ding. Is, is, did they also used to hang up on the wall? And they, is that why you say hang up the phone? Yes. <gasps> wow, my millennial brain can't even handle it. You're so old. She's on overload. <laughs> also, Todd and Tony uh, did some consorting. And then, of course, you all did too. So, um, Drew started out last week's live by saying, by doing a nice super chat, and then saying for all super chats of that evening, he will be matching it. Which he did, and you all... And I didn't know what to do. ...came through in droves, amazingly, and he matched it, and it was for a particular purpose for us completing our Pappy Van Winkle vertical, or Van Winkle, if you want to, because some of them aren't actually Pappies. They're right, they're Van, Van Winkle Winkles. family. Uh, vertical, the one that was missing was the 20-year. And through the Super Chats, and through some awesome uh, PayPal donations... What'd we get, Chad? Oh, snap. We got this. Can you believe it? 
Can you believe <sighs> it? Look at it. It's beautiful. 2019. Chad's just really excited because it's completing that hole yes. in that shelf. <laughs> Pappy Van Winkle, 20 year. If y'all haven't seen the back of a Pappy, 20, it's got him playing golf. With <laughs> Completes his, another round. Yeah, another round with his uh, uh, dog, um, Caddy. Oh, See? that's yeah. so sweet. Look, so, the universe is trying to tell us something. <laughs> right. I, yeah, I guess I guess so. No, but we all owe you guys a big thank you yes. Um, yes. for making this happen. Absolutely. What uh, a nice birthday gift. A, a lot of people came through with some great super chats, some great uh, PayPal uh, sends, whatever you want to call them. Um, get Todd, Todd and Tony uh, with, a, with a big chunk. Of course, Drew himself. Uh, I can't name everyone because a lot of people went into this. Yeah. This will be uncorked. You've unlocked two episodes. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. This will be in a flight fight, a pappy flight fight. Uh, yes, this will be enjoyed and, and studied and... Um, so we've got to do an uncorking. Scrutinized. Yes. We also and then we've got to do the flight. flight. We also have the 15 year that we need to still uncork. So you've unlocked several episodes. Yes. Congratulations on reaching this level. Now here's the other thing. We found, uh, and also thanks to Matt Preston, he was a, um, what do you call those people who are like the go-betweens? A middleman. A middleman or, or a facilitator. A messenger. To no, find someone who was selling. And, you know, we talk about how we don't agree with secondary prices a lot of times and we argue against it and so forth. Sure. Well, this is the only one in the collection that we didn't get at retail, but... You know, you only get so much luck, and I really feel like Correct. our happy luck had been used up. There is no, but, there is like, I think it's like, what, maybe 5% chance yeah. you're going to get this, out. like even and, less than that probably. I mean, I got my number called second to get the Pappy 23, which is unbelievable. We tried again last year for this one, and we didn't get it. So. But here's the good part. Uh, again, through Matt, and thank, thank you to him, um, found someone who was selling one because they they needed some... Some funds. Well, it's an interesting time right now. It is. So we feel good that this went to someone who needed some extra It was a good handoff. Bucks right now. Yeah. It helped that person, helped us, helped you all. You all helped us. There was a lot of helping. It was a circle of helping. Yes. Now, the other good thing is because we got this at what I consider a really good deal, mm -hmm. we have some money left over from the Super Chats, the donations, all that, we're going to take to Justin's House of Bourbon. And we're going to get, we're gonna something, get else. something else cool that will also be for you guys. Yay! So none from last week will be just, you know, squandered. It would whatever, never whatever be want, squandered, but it say. will be spent on something cool. Yes. So seriously, thank you yes. guys so, so much. So excited. And the fact that this, you know, happened on a, a big birthday milestone just makes it all the sweeter. What milestone is it, Chad? Ah, uh, birthday. So thank you to that. He won't. Now, I know we had some super chats going on. Trash uh, man one. Through that. And we probably need to, I yeah, guess, go, I'll back go back up. And... He says, happy birthday, brother. Love you, man. Thank you. Appreciate uh, it. That's it. No, that's oh, a new sorry. That's a new well, one. Well, I saw Joseph's and he said, um, I wanted Sarah to get her squirrel back. Uh, nobody ever took that squirrel from me. Nope. You'll have to pry it out of my cold, dead hand. <laughs> oh. You guys, I'm really tired. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I think I'm just like drunk on sleepiness because I've been working in the garden all day. And I'm like... Pro I'm and yesterday. Literally propped up right now. Yeah. My lower back is killing me. And I've been so doing this is helpful. Some sanding on um, my shelves. We've been working together. And, and routing. <laughs> it's yeah. the farthest we've been away from each other in six weeks. Seriously. <laughs> yeah. William Robart says, happy birthday, Chad. Eric and I are celebrating our 18th wedding anniversary today. Cheers. <gasps> that, Cheers. That's a triangle. Cheers. Like a triangle. Now, is there anyone above? Congrats on tolerating each other for 18 Joseph. years. No, that was it. We said already. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're cool. good. Trust me. All right. <laughs> Let me drive. <laughs> You're driving. You're driving. All right. Can't be a backseat live streamer no you can't yeah scott says happy birthday chad remember you're only as old as you feel also i made the bourbon butterscotch pie yesterday and now mm. i have diabetes <laughs> <So good. laughs> he's got the diabetes oh i was congratulations i might have to do a video on this german chocolate cake at some point um but because it would definitely go well on the icing for sure um 
But that thing is hard, man. I, I don't know how I feel about putting that. I'm not like good at making it super pretty, so. No, it looks great. I did okay. It was all right. I could use another round to, to try. <laughs> another round. To, you know, finesse that thing. It was really good though. Actually, I'm gonna have some after this. Uh, sorry, one second. Wow, this is, I mean, I know it's your birthday, but <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of rude. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll continue. We got two bottles of Booker's, not one, but two bottles of Booker's from Clark and Betsy. Now I think this is right. Glazner? Glasner. Glazner. Glasner? Mm. Clark and Betsy, thank you so much for those Booker's. Yeah, that's awesome. Of course they sent Sip a while. Can you believe so I was worried that we were going to run out soon because that was hands down my favorite one up until this point. Now I think it's back to the ones I can think of. Kitchen table, sip a while. That's my number one is sip a while. And then I love, we've been going back to this 2020 over and over and over again. So that's been really good. Uh, and then of course like Booker's 30th, but I was just talking about the regular ones on the shelf. So there, that was the last thing on there the list. You go. Now you can show the, you said you wanted to show your birthday presents. I'm not yes. saying you have to, you just told me you wanted to. I do want to do that. So that, that was the last thing on the agenda. Uh, I want to get to some voicemails. Let's do voicemails. And let's see. Do, do, do. I know it's yes. your birthday, but I'm thirsty. Go for it. Well, I'll get, just finish this Kentucky out. Get whatever you like. No, I'll wait for you. It's your birthday. Uh, um, hmm. Let's see. What else we got? Uh, James Wolverton, again, with a super chat, says, A favorite moment at Total Wine when you got called. Oh, yeah. Oh, we both got called that day. That was the day that... Was that the day that I was distracted by the dog? Yes. <laughs> I was yes, literally sure. playing with the puppy, and they were like... Chad was like, Sarah. And I was like, what? Leave me alone. I'm playing with this dog. And he was like, your number just got called. And I was like, oh. Hmm. Well, I was just entertained. Just literally rolling around on the ground with a puppy. Yep. Um, oh, Pam's here, apparently. Oh, Pam. Hi, Pam. Hi, Pam. Yeah. Um, but yeah, and I went into that side room Ooh, and I fun. I was so, you know, disoriented <laughs> because, you know, puppy. And then puppy. I, I, he was like, go, go. And so I ran in and then I was like, wait. I forgot what our priorities were. I don't remember what I'm supposed to do here. So I went in and they still had some like Pappy, I think they had, well, they had some Van Winkle 10 or 12, James could tell you, I don't know what was there. And they had Booker's 30th and like a whole slew of other things. And I was like, I think I wanna get the Booker's 30th, but I'm not sure if that's what Chad wants me to do. And then uh, James was like, damn it woman, do whatever you wanna do. He didn't use those words, but uh, I was like, okay, I want the Booker's 30th. And aren't you glad Yes. Aren't you glad I made my own decision? And we've actually got we've some got some back there. right back here. Okay. I think I've, uh, let me just get this up. Check, 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 check. Siblings, siblings, siblings. What are you doing? Doing the mic. Okay. Here. Hey, Chad. Happy birthday. This is Mike in New Jersey. I'm a UK graduate. Uh, and I'm going to raise a Mictor's 10 in your honor for your birthday. Sarah, how's it going? Chad, so. Sorry, that was not on speaker, so I had it pointed in the in the wrong place. So I, let me just uh, play that again. We're, we're listening to voicemails. Hey, Chad, happy birthday. This is Mike in New Jersey. I'm a UK graduate, and I'm going to raise a Mictor's 10 in your honor for your birthday. Sarah, how's it going? Yeah, how's it going? <laughs> so the question is, Sarah, how's it going? Uh, it's going all right. Like Good. I said, I'm pretty sore. Uh, I could use, you know, a lot of pillows behind me right now, but that's okay. <laughs> Maybe some light muscle relaxers, but that's sure. all. That's all I could use. This is working fine, <laughs> uh, in case you were wondering. Uh, <laughs> just, you know, do whatever I can. <laughs> so, yeah, that was cool. Can you guys hear those? Let us know. Um, yeah, let's Yeah, know. I think they can hear it. Yeah, okay. Mictors. Uh, yeah, the collar did have good taste. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Proceed. Uh, I'm going to do one more here. Do -do. I wish these were easier to access. Well, I'm just gonna... Why can't I get it on speaker? There's no, like, put it on speaker button right here. You mean the speaker button? Yeah. Not there. Oh, weird. No. Yeah. Okay. 
at Costco.com it's at or on the mobile app for temporary changes, including person. warehouse and gas station um, hours, and the, special you, hours for Sarah, seniors, for priority warehouse access for health care right. workers and first responders. Okay. There's two messages on so top of each other. Weird. Why is that also a Costco message? I don't know. What the heck? Oh, thank you, Lil. Uh, I saw Chris um, for the Super Chats. While you figure that out, well, I gotta... Get my priorities in order. You can have someone you're done. Ooh, that was a bigger pour than I intended. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Chris, it, it like layered. I think, oh, that's sad. You just turn I'm gonna that see off. If... I can't hear myself think. <laughs> Um, anyways, Chris says, happy birthday, Chad. Great to see the LMDW behind you on the cart. Party like it's Sunday night lockdown in Kentucky. It, it is that. Thank you, Chris. We will. It's just too, you can't, this, I can't listen to that. <laughs> Maybe we'll. Your birthday has been wonderful. Remember, it's just a number, but things do start to catch up with you, so hydrate, my son. Anyways. Hopefully, we'll get to hang out again soon, and this pops for you. That sounds like Tammy. Yeah, I know. So, I don't know. Well, we'll have to ask her. I don't know who we'll, that was. We'll have to ask her. Yeah. Because I think she also had a message from Costco. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's okay. We'll figure it out. Thank you for the message. Um, again, uh, why you got to make me do this? Sa Sachin? Is that right? I don't know. Happy birthday, Chad. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate it. They can all hear. Mm. Yay. Okay. Okay. It was Tammy. Okay. Mm. Tammy, I'm so sorry that Tammy, Co you, you better Costco, call Costco really back. spoke over you, <laughs> but I think you got to call them. I don't know what's going on. Um, Tori <laughs> Duncan says, Lordy, Lordy, look who's drinking bourbon. Drinking a 40. Happy this birthday, was, uh, what, Chad. What I almost called it. <laughs> it's not. But I, I wasn't, wouldn't be hey, drinking a 40. Did you, um, is this this? Yes, but let me just, um. Oh, okay, sure. Just a touch. Sure. There we go. Thank you. Well, no, no, no. You take some, too. I just wanted. Oh. Maybe even that's still too much. Yeah, go ahead. This stuff <laughs> doesn't come easy, you know? That's right. This'll do me. Well, no. You need more. Okay. <laughs> it's your birthday. Oh, it smells like coconut now. <laughs> God bless. <laughs> Here. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't, don't, don't even worry about it. Stupid coconut Ooh. lip gloss. Thought it was being tropical. Just being Thought a pain it in being my tropical. ass. So we got everything on that checklist. Yes. Yes. Cool. No. Cool. You well, unless well, you don't. Yeah. No, I show do. Your... I do. Okay. I do. Here, let me turn down the phone uh, thing right now. Ooh. I love Booker's thirtieth. Mm, so good. No, this doesn't smell like coconut. Well, I won't be wearing this lip gloss again. So, from my lovely wife. Donald, happy Thank birthday you, Donald. from the knights who say me. me. <laughs> Someone got that reference last week. So this is one of my birthday presents there from we go. Sarah. It's dark, so the light. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah. Um, this, I think at one time, Came with a bottle. Yeah, 86, 86 proof. proof. Uh, oh, the Old Taylor Distillery. So, mm -hmm. yeah, Old Taylor, 86 proof, and it is a... It's a safe, but it's also an ice chest. An ice chest. So it's not really a safe. That's really, really cool. Really neat. Thank you. And... Uh, I did some quarantine Instagram shopping. <laughs> Look at that. That is This vintage. is some sort of vintage painting. And beautiful. I don't have the year, sadly. Yeah. Um. But very cool, right? Very cool. And this. Those are just two of the gifts. Actually, this bottle. Nope. <laughs> this, <laughs> this bottle. bottle is, is over there. Yeah. We have one. I, I got that um, for, Christmas for Christmas for Sarah. Yeah. It's an empty bottle. It's empty. Yeah. And also... Sadly. And you gave this to me early. I did give this to you early. When they brought the things to the house and dropped them off, because that's how quarantine Instagram shopping works, uh, I 
you know, I Instagram felt like I had Instagram or to... Etsy? No, Instagram. Instagram, okay. Uh, people are selling stuff on their stories now. Yeah. It's crazy. And then there's a, a local, thr like a thrift shop, mm -hmm. uh, I guess. Um, they're kind of high-end stuff, but I yeah. saw it on their story, and I was like, I buy this now. So what's really cool about this, so this is one quart. Uh, this is Julius Kessler and Company, Paris, Kentucky, which, which is... is where I was raised. Mm -hmm. uh, Seventh District, Bourbon County, Kentucky, Paris, Kentucky. Uh, so, I mean, this bottle's empty, but just to have this bottle is super cool because when you were in school there was no when you were living there there weren't distilleries there. oh no well i mean long long gone long gone so i think yeah. that's cool yeah i mean they're back now but um mm. long gone so that's a try to do some research and see if i can date when this is from but super cool yeah the things that you find on yeah Instagram. absolutely uh cheers is this i drank that 30th pretty quickly <laughs> it was delicious um uh, derek says happy birthday best day ever happy it's birthday also to you derek his birthday yes and matt preston says cheers y'all thank you matt. you made it in thank you for coming thank Appreciate you it. for the blind thank samples. you for this pour and for the super chat that's too much and thank you for facilitating the pappy told that story too i don't know if that was before you got in here or not but, but we, told, uh, we told them stories thank you much um, let's see. I saw a question that I wanted to answer. Someone mm -hmm. said, oh, Kelly said, what do you do with all your empties? We save. Save them. Them. Pretty much all of them. Yep. I think. Which came in handy for our wedding because we use them as our centerpieces. Yep. Um, but the plan is to eventually make stuff out of them. Yeah. One day when we have time. <laughs> That's right. So, you know, in like a year or two. Well, you've seen, um, five that I've made. If you watch, uh, uh, Flight fights? Yeah, they're they're in flight fights they're on our or, big or, set. or or bourbon nights. The five hang, hanging like pendant lights that have the bottom. People cut always out. ask where we got that chandelier. Chad made it. Made them. Made them. He made it. Cutting some glass. Yep. So I want to get back to that. Yeah, flower vases. You know, you can make candles. You can do all kinds of crafts. Yep. Um, Looks like uh, Trevor Wilson lamps. is pouring some Weller foolproof. He's not messing around. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> We got some super oh, chats. Oh, and there's Matt from Whiskey Crusaders. Thank you for the happy birthday. Yes, we have some super chats. I drank all mine. Okay, well. Is it my birthday? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> Is Pam still here? <laughs> I'm so tired, you guys. Hmm. Oh. Hmm, what's next? What's next? No. Yes. <gasps> okay. Oh, we got some big ones. Okay. Um, Are any of these clean? No. No. I drank all. Oh boy. One moment, please. Makes me nervous. There we go. Whew, that was a, oh, that one did not want to let go. Tight fit. So this is the 139.4 Elijah Craig barrel proof of yesteryear. Probably 2015 or 16. 139.4. The highest proof Elijah Craig that we own. Just a wee bit. Well, whatever you feel like is appropriate. I feel like that's appropriate. Okay. I'm going to save my Booker's 30th. That sounds good. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and do this triangle for all of you in a row. And that. And that too. Come in. Uh, <laughs> Brian says, sipping on some beaten biscuits. Here's to you, Chad. Happy birthday. Art Thank says, you. happy birthday, Chad. May you find something phenomenal at Justin's House of Bourbon. Ouch. Pinched my thumb. Well, that's what you get for saying those mean things about it. You know what they say, pinch your thumb, your birthday, it's good luck all year round. Is that right? No. Okay. Derek Ellis just sent clapping hands. Thank you for the super chat. Thank you. And, oh, no, it's a high five because they're, I see now. Two different hands. Two different hands. Got <laughs> <laughs> I'm, all, I'm all caught up. Uh, <laughs> Ashley says, happy birthday, Chad. What's the next vertical you want to complete? I would love to complete the William Heaven Hill but I know it's impossible. That's impossible. The first one was so limited that... And so long ago. And so long ago that... Um, impossible. I have I have the odd ones. I have three, five, and seven. So, so you would need... To get one, two, four, four, six, and I think the next one will be eight. Eight. So you need one, two, four, and six. Yeah. Okay. Uh, but that... That's never gonna Come happen. on. <laughs> Well, well, we have our whole lives. That's right. We have our whole lives. I'm not in a hurry. Uh, Brian says, since last week's super chat was for the birthday, this week's obviously has to be for the puppy fund. <laughs> yes. 
raising a pour for the ver uh, of the very last of our delicious to toast Chad's birthday. <gasps> Cheers. Oh, raising a pour. Thank you, Brian. I love it. That's awesome. Scott says, now that you have all the Van Winkles, what's next? I think we just answered yeah. that. Mm -hmm. Um, Outside of that, though, I, okay. as far as what's possible, go for it. Would like to get one of every BTAC. We have two missing. Uh, not of the same year. Just not of the of same every. year. Just okay. of any year. Sazerac 18 and the Eagle Rare. Interesting. Uh, These are all Buffalo Trace things. 17. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the... The William Heaven Hill was McKenna. Or, not McKenna. <laughs> Heaven Hill. Really? <laughs> William Larue Weller? Words. What are you talking about? The William Heaven Hill was oh, Heaven Hill. Oh, yeah, Heaven Hill. Not Buffalo right. Trace. Yes. But then why did I say McKenna? Gotcha. I don't know. Hello. <laughs> I don't know. I have uh -huh. completed um, a Jefferson's Ocean vertical up to Ocean's 11 because I wanted to have up to Ocean's 11. But and then they kept coming and it was like a well, I know, but I, I, I stopped after 11. But, um, yeah, 1 through 11. You have 1 through 11. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Yeah, took a while. Those are in our home, and I didn't even know about it. <laughs> James says, happy birthday, Chad, sipping on some Granny's Batch. Nice. nice. What do you think about this, uh, Elijah Craig, 139.4? I think it's delicious. Mm. I also think, you know, I feel kind of bad because I just read all these comments in a row. I mean, Art, thank you so much yes. for that big super chat. Yes, like, I can't believe awesome. I was just like, I'm going to read through this. You know? <laughs> no, that's very cool. I'm just going to give you another. Ashley your own with, a, with a big one, too. Yeah. Yes, and Ashley. Mm -hmm. But one triangle for you. One triangle to rule them all. Yes. Yeah. I'm sorry that I just breezed over those. I've had a long day. <laughs> Been a great day, though. They're going to make me go out in the yard every Sunday now because they're like, we like it better when she's tired ah. and you give her high proof stuff. Whiskey Behavior is asking, oldest bur 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 bourbon you've had that you actually enjoyed? We had one, a pre-prohibition uh, at, a, at a tasting at Justin's House of Bourbon that, remember that one they had to pour through a sieve because oh, the cork yeah. had gotten down into it? I I enjoyed that. Also the one that... But what was the proof on it? Is it, what was the question? Oldest. Oldest. Oh, I thought it was oldest, highest proof. My bad. No, it's just oldest. So yeah, we had some pre-prohibition that... um. What was it, like Jordan or something from 1917, mm. that sample? I mm -hmm. mean, that was enjoyable. I don't think I've had a pre-prohibition that I haven't enjoyed, but I maybe enjoyed it's uh, different, more though. than others. It's yeah. more like it's a historical enjoyment so and less like thick. a... Yeah, less like a, I'm craving bourbon and so I'm going to have this. Like it's, that, it's like you're appreciating a moment in time. Yeah, that one at Justin's, I think, was pretty low proof. It might have been like 80 or 86. Yeah. and. Kind but of even young, still, but it was so dark. I mean, it looked like a ten-year, one hundred and thirty proof. It yep. was wow, wow. Yeah. Um, oh, he meant age statement. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, of bourbon. How old was that OFC that we tried? Well, it's got to be the Heaven Hill, uh, twenty-seven year. Oh yeah, which we had with Todd and Tony. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at you guys! Like made a little place in Chad's heart. That's right. How sweet. Yep. I don't think I've had any bourbon aged over More than 27. twenty-seven years. Yeah. You know, I think you're right. I think that's the oldest thing I've had too, and that was good. We've had a Scotch that was like forty-five. But that's years different. Or Scotch years. Yeah. It's like talking about human years and dog years. It's mm -hmm. like not. It's True. not the same thing. Yeah. You know. Drew. So I had a um, Heaven Hill. 72 yesterday, <gasps> Drew Bolin. Weird taste. Maybe, Maybe lead. lead. Was it from a decanter, Drew? Uh, super caramel flavor, but a weird... Sorry, the chat's moving. I'm losing it. But a weird flavor with it. Okay, mm. yeah, the chat will do this, and I'm like, where'd it go? See, yeah, I, fe I feel like my... Again, the sweet spot for me is going to be like 70s-ish. Yeah. Like, even up to like mid-80s or through the 80s um, is when I feel like... You just, especially with turkey, but even just like beam and other stuff, I feel like that is a golden age right now because it's still, I feel like maintains its integrity. So mm -hmm. it's not too old to where you're getting, you know, some issues with just it being in existence for so long. It's right. like Mr. Meeseeks. Was it even meant to exist for that long? <laughs> um, 
But it still keeps all those good flavors of the True. you know the way that they were doing things at that time. Matt's pointing out that we've certainly had the forty-five year Glenlivet that he uh, gave us, and yes, we certainly have. Yes, but that was the question was so th about bourbon, though, right? Yes, but I, I brought up that one because it was at the um, uh, La Quinta. I was thinking Me Hacienda. Right. No, that's what we had like for a, dinner on Friday. It may have been like a fifty-year-old or something. I can't even remember. Um, anyway. I want to, well, let's do Joey Bag of Donuts here. Okay. Thank you, Joey. Says, I'm with Brian this week is for the puppy. Joey Tony, sorry. <laughs> toasting your big, or what? My eyes. Uh, toasting your big old day with an with an all beam night, Baker's Bookers, and my favorite Knob Creek 12. Mm. How's it going, Sarah? <laughs> <laughs> That's question of the night. How's it going, Sarah? It's going all right. Good. That's awesome. Thank you, Joey Tony Bag of Donuts. Appreciate it. There. Bing. This is, this is, um, What's the word? Compounding? <laughs> the feelings that I was having things. before. All I right. think it might be my birthday. I'll play, play another voicemail here. Hi, this is Brian, better known as uh, Kilco. Kilco. I was just going to ask you, what distillery do you think you'll go to first once all of this is over? And uh, also... Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Oh, we don't have to rights you. to play. Uh, you better cut it off. And it's so on. Happy birthday to you. The <laughs> flesh someday. Bye. Someday. Thank you, Kilko. Someday we'll see other people in the flesh again. Yeah. So the, the question was, what distillery will we go to first once you can go to distilleries? I know my answer. I don't know. I would like for us to go to Willet so you could take the tour because you've never done it. Okay, so my answer was going to be Bartstown well, Bourbon Company. Ooh, yeah. Because we've been yeah. there multiple times, but we've never done the official tour. Mm -hmm. um, and I want to eat. So. And she wants to eat. And I want to eat. Yeah. Which is out of surprise. Um, <laughs> but but while, but while we're out there, uh, we could, you know, I want to hit up Heaven Hill because yeah. they've... I would imagine are doing a lot of construction while the they are everything's closed because I know still, that they're re you know redoing a lot. They so. were still working on that warehouse when I went there to get the, the yeah. Old foots. I mean, if I were them, I would take advantage of there not being any people around and go ahead and, of course, you know you have construction yeah. and I'm sure a lot of regulations around that right now. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, and then, you know, yeah, will it? And maybe maybe hit up Lux Row again, go pet that dog. Oh yeah, <laughs> well the dog. Isn't it there all the time? That's if the it's main lady be, in charge. He's gonna be there. Okay, he's gonna be there. The stars will align, and he'll be there. After what doing was his our, name? He was so good. I don't remember. After doing our virtual tour of Buffalo Trace, I want to go on the Hard Hat tour, and yes. I want to go on the Bourbon Pompeii. So that was gonna be my next answer tour. Uh, so yeah, I, the virtual tour was awesome, and if you haven't seen that video, it's like two videos ago. Um, really cool, really fun. The and app's the got trivia. We did. Pretty good. We missed. We missed, we missed a one. Few. Um, every every time someone's like, "You're you guys are experts," I'm gonna be like, uh, "I missed three questions on the <laughs> Buffalo Trace trivia." Okay, so I'm not. <laughs> I think it was two, but who's counting? Okay. You you are. Um, so that's like the you know the next best thing, but it also makes you like want to go see it in person. So I think Buffalo Trace has got to be there too. Yes. All right. And um, going to do another. Then I want to just you know do our planned trip had everything organized for our trip for patrons to do a uh, whiskey row in louisville and then you know that Stuff was supposed happens. to be for next month literally like four weeks from now and now we won't be going so so sad yeah um but right. one day here's another uh voicemail here hey guys love it. uh okay you're always being asked what are your favorites now let's hear some of the top five Worst ones you've had from big distilleries and top five worst from craft. All right, have a good one. Bye. I I didn't get that. Did you? Who is a popster? No, I love it. Um, I would just say things that didn't gel with me. Oh, <laughs> what a what a political answer. It's a political. I answer. love it. I love it. Because you know everyone doesn't like everything, right? Right. And something's for somebody. You know, if and if we were well, all the same, then the world would be really boring. All right, let's quit dancing around <laughs> it. Um, we are not fans of the 90 Proof Maker's Mark. We said that before. Well, yeah. However, we are fans of the 46, the 101, the cast strength. The private select. Private select. So that's one 
uh, one of their expressions that we don't like, but we don't like it. Um, yeah. Tim Branch isn't our jam. Who turned that on? So that's two. You know, I'll be the first one to say, I, I, you know, but it's not that strong of a dislike, especially now that we've had more things. I was going to say just like the regular on the shelf Angel's Envy, which I, which I don't, I, I'll be perfectly honest. Like I don't enjoy it, but I like it a lot better than, than some other things that we've had. Um, this is a really hard question. I think five is too many. I could sit here all night, uh, but I love Angel's Envy. The rye is really good. We like the cast strength. And then we just had that, um, What's that collection called? Cellar. Cellar. I always forget because I want to call it whatever the oak finish is. Ooh. And then craft is hard because craft, since they're not like in in your world as much as the main ones. Yeah. They're more on the periphery. Well, I think it's you also about where you of, live. Too. Well, you, what I'm getting at is you can kind of forget about them. If you don't like them and they're not all hitting you up with advertising, they can leave the memory. So I think a lot more of ones that I do like, like um, New Riff and uh, Wilderness Trail and, and ones like that. Dickel. Ah, uh, there's some Dickel that they we don't enjoy. They reminded us. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Dickel, um, very good. What else, what else is not, is not great? Um, I can't even, I don't know. That's so, cause you know, we just don't normally, spend time obsessing over the things that we don't like. We just try to try focus to keep it on positive. Well, we only have so many opportunities to to supply content, and so I guess for us it's like let us tell you what you should buy instead of being like you shouldn't buy. <laughs> Avoid like that, this at all but costs. But you know what I mean? Like <laughs> for example, we were talking about that video on I think it was Mashed. Yeah, Mashed. The other day and they're like 10 bourbon or 10 things you should never drink. And I was like I'm not going to tell anyone they shouldn't do that. I'll give you my opinion well, on what I think you should I'll get. I'll tell you exactly why they do that is for clicks. Clickbait. I mean, that's very clickbaity. Clickbait. Sarah, what would you... How, I know that this has kind of become your bourbon, but how would you feel about opening up the Le Maison du Whiskey? I mean, I feel good. Okay. I feel pretty good. Because we have finished one of these, and now we need another one open. We read that one. I'm trying to make Ooh, sure. Look at Patrick that. Fulmer, I see your super chat, and I apologize for the delay. It says, hi, kids. Sorry I'm late. Cheers. We, we will, will cheers, cheers you, you with some Le Maison du Whiskey in this live on Quirking. We will. Here we go. I hope Chris and Lil are still here. Yeah, this is from them. It went. Oh, what a pop. It went from Frankfurt, which is 35 Ooh. minutes from here, all the way to Australia. Or no, wait. All the to way to France. France, and then to Australia. To Australia. To and Brisbane. Then back here so it's it, it's well traveled it is well traveled much like don she's, Nishida's. Seen, she's seen some things <laughs> <laughs> yes okay Ready? has this been here the whole time what this coaster maybe i don't know yeah i think yeah i think it has wow well i guess i'm just gonna leave it at this point so if you I all thought it was in the shot <laughs> y'all aren't um familiar this is Basically a store pick, but they get the special treatment from Blanton's. The special, they get their special. own label and all this, and it's uh, 120 proof as opposed to the 93. Um, so limited edition, specially bottled and labeled for La Maison du Whisky. Uh, 120 proof limited edition. Bam. So this is for mm. the Super Chat. This one is so different. It has like a really really dark cherry note with some other things going on it is just like mm. very unique it's yes good. it's good it's good i like it um someone said what should i pay for eh taylor rye uh, i usually see it for like 90 is that right 89.99 79.99 yeah i think it's normally 70 i would pay that yeah, would, I'd pay... Wouldn't pay more than 90. No, I was going to say 85 to I 90, would, yeah. yeah, I would not pay more than 90. So yeah. if someone's like, we'll give it to you for 150, you'd be like, okay, bye. Yeah, oh, thanks. I'll go... If that's the mm. case, go get a Pikesville Rye. It's like 45 $55. Just be like, all right, I'll just take this. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to play another... Sorry, that was sassy. <laughs> Message here? I need to tell... <gasps> what? 
Brian. That kind of just. Uh, is this also for the puppy foot? <laughs> <laughs> whoa. Brian, wow. whoa. I wish we had a jingle for Brian you. Brian Gillespie. Thank you. He says, happy birthday, brother. Cheers to you. Cheers to you, sir. Oh, man. Wow. Whoa. Mind blown. Blown. Dang. What do we even do? Brian, uh, what would you like us to open? Yeah, absolutely. And Perry um, says, I love when it's Sarah's birthday. Cheers, y'all. I'm celebrating. We're celebrating. We're celebrating. Thank We're you, Perry. Celebrating. I can't let him celebrate alone. Appreciate you, it. You drink this. <laughs> I think Perry may have left us a message. I'm not sure. Um, Bear, bear. Uh, but this one is... But Brian, for real, what do you want us to... Yes. We've got a lot back here, if you can Let see. Let us know. Or if you know that we have something, just yell would, it out. Would you I'll like me... Fetch it. Would you like Actually, me to... Actually, Chad will uh, go fetch it, because I can't walk. Would you like me to talk really close into this mic for the rest of the episode? Because um, I hate it when you do that. I might... I can do that. All right, here's a voicemail. It makes me want to... Ah, uh, I remember it well. It was but a wee last when we ushered in the 1980s. It's hard to believe that someone born after that time could be now in their 40s. But seriously, happy birthday, Chad. We wish you uh, many years of health, happiness, and prosperity going forward. 40s aren't so bad. Tammy and I have been there for a little while now. Happy birthday again, mm -hmm. and cheers. I love it. Okay, so that was Brian Brennicky. Um when it comes up in the email, it just gives the phone number. So I didn't realize that that was Brian until Aww. when he said Tammy. I knew the voice, but I couldn't, yeah, um, I know. you know. Yeah. Maybe I should put this more in the middle so you can hear the speaker. I can hear it. You can hear it? Okay. Kind of. Yeah. Maybe okay. I leaned a little bit. <laughs> uh, Whiskey Steve says, happy birthday, Chad, and cheers, everyone. Thank you. Appreciate it. I didn't see, mm. I didn't see Brian say what he wants us to drink. So... Um, you know, I don't really know what to do about that, but I guess we'll just choose something. We shall, and I'm gonna play. I mean, I'm still drinking this, to be I'm honest. Gonna play another, another massage here. A massage. Mm -hmm. Boop. I'm glad you're the one doing that, and not me. All right, I'm a little bit late in getting in here, but what do you expect from me? But I just wanted to call in and say happy birthday, Chad, and how's it going, Sarah? And I love you guys, and I miss you all a lot. And I'm, of course, watching you right now. Chad's phone just rang because I was calling to leave this message. I apologize I was so late, but, you know, that's just, that's just how I roll. Anyway, happy birthday, Chad, number redacted for obvious reasons. Love you guys so much. Can't wait to see you and drink with you soon. Bye. 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 That's it. Bye. Bye. Happy birthday. Okay. That's your, it. your mom's here and she says, Lily says, Happy birthday, Uncle Chad. Uh, that's his niece. My niece. Mm. That's, oh, that's awesome. I love her. Hi, Lily. If she, ha, Hi, Mom. Uh, no, she's, she's not watching. She's not watching. She's everybody. not watching. She's not watching. She might be watching. She's not watching. <laughs> she's not watching. Just the parts where we don't. Let's just say for YouTube's sake that she is 21 years old. <laughs> Lily's is Chad's niece and she's 21. Yeah. And one day. She's not watching. Um, so, yeah, did, did, did he say what we should drink, Brian? Oh, I didn't see anything. Did anyone catch that? Did I miss something? Well, he might not know what we have. <laughs> uh, well, you know, I said if you know. If, okay, well, um, anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller, Fry, Fry. Great Scott. <laughs> we watched Back to the Future last night. And it was like... Had some Booker's 30th. Uh, 11 something. And I was like, can we watch the second one? Chad was like, no, we have to go to bed. You didn't ask if we watched the second I one. I did so. I said, can we watch the next one? And you were like, uh, oh, it's too late. Because <laughs> he's... I need my beauty rest. And it was going to be on live. <laughs> um... Did you get all? I did get them all. I did. I I did. Okay. <laughs> I do that on purpose. All right. Next time you're in the car, I'm gonna be like, you just make a right here. You make a right. <laughs> this is where you make the right. Mm. That's good. Robot Scott says, "Sorry, missing the live tonight. Have to catch it on replay." Happy birthday, Chad. Thank you. Uh, Brian Gillespie with the twenty dollars and says, "Open up, happy." I would. What about the 15? 
No. No, he wants well, to make an episode out of it. What about... <laughs> what if you go get the 23 that's already open? Ah, uh, how about that, Brian? How about a Pappy Van Winkle 23? I think he might cry otherwise, so go go on. Yeah, I mean... I can't... Just from a business standpoint. Just from... <laughs> From a business standpoint. Business standpoint. We could do a live uncorking. We totally could. We did. We just did. We did with this one. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but, but, you know, with all the effort... Plus, I haven't stood up yet. Correct. You haven't stood up yet. Um, with all the effort that went into procuring that 20-year, it definitely... what It needs the pomp and circumstance. Brian said, Pappy or bust. I'll get a Pappy. But he said $100, so... Okay, he's going. He's going downstairs. He's getting some things. Um, whoa. I don't even know what to say. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like he's going to tell me what to do as far as the uncorkings go. So I think you guys think maybe I have like more say in this than I actually do. No, we're the, the creative and the producer and we're constantly arguing about, uh, not arguing, but having, um, Delightful debates about what we should save for content and what sh what should we not. Um, and I'm usually on the side of we should open it right now and enjoy it. And then I'm reminded later that that's, you know, that we can't share it with you guys. So, okay. Oh, uh, okay. Come, stop. I can't. I, well, you bring what you want. I have no feelings about this. It's your birthday. And, and, and Brian wants to see what Brian wants to see. <laughs> and he paid good money, so you give him a show. He did. <laughs> wow. Why do I feel dirty? Um, so we do have... Heck, I'll put my arm in a wood chipper for 400 bucks. That's what... 420. Hey, 420. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> wow. Uh, we do have a, a little Pappy 23 here. It has been opened. There is an uncorking for it. Um, but we will gladly taste this. Or... Brian, we will uncork live at a lot B, a 12 year. Brian, what it's say up, you? It's up to Brian. What if we do. It's up to Brian. No, Look, it's, it's up even, to you. It, but even, it's also your birthday. It's even dusty. We should do something for your birthday. Should. Should. Brian, you don't have to super chat. I will look for you. Right, right. No. <laughs> yeah, sorry. No pressure or anything. Um, you speak now. <laughs> Yes. But, whoa, thank you, you so much. That's you. crazy. Yes, that is awesome. You'll be watching the chat. I'm That's gonna play, why I'm like... Mm. I'm going to play another uh, voicemail here. I love these photos on the back. Hi, Ted. Hey, sir, with an H. It's Jeff and Joanna in California, better known as the couple that first dared to ask the question, brother and sister... <laughs> boyfriend girlfriend that's right so we're calling to wish you a happy 40th birthday chad assuming that's the big number um you. we're gonna be sipping some special 2013 angels envy cat strength out of the box and our question is now that you're 40 will you dare to shave your head all right guys happy birthday happy birthday well, um, I mean, that might be the answer to the haircut thing. Just shave my head. <laughs> I don't but, dare, uh, don't dare go near this question. Yeah. So, <laughs> so we have a super chat from Jack saying, happy birthday, Chad. Any plans on the next challenge coin? My Kentucky and Texas coin need a friend. Yes, I'm actually very late at putting uh, a poll up on Patreon about what state and why. For the next, uh, maybe I'll do that. Uh, do that tomorrow. Go ahead and put that up, so we can figure that out. Um, so, no, but we are listening to reasons why it should be the next state. Yes. And then Brian. Brian again says, "Go big or go home." Chad, Chad it's your birthday. I agree with him. Mm -hmm. I, you know, we just had this discussion when and you Jeff. were off camera. My my instinct is usually like, "Let's do it." I mean, we have two beautiful bottles sitting in front of us, but it's it is true. your birthday. And this is your bottle. So I can't say what happens to it. <laughs> well. <laughs> when are you going to turn 40 again? I'm sorry. <laughs> 
Wow. They said it. They outed you. <laughs> we all knew. I've been saying it for forever. Um, <laughs> okay, let's, let's, I mean, this is still on the table. We can still drink this later, but let's go ahead and do a live uncorking of this. All right. Loppy, let's do it. Let's get ourselves two clean glasses, though. Okay, okay. Thanks for getting up so that I don't have to. Uh, I don't think I could, yeah. Let's use our two deformed ones. Cool, deformed is fine. It'll be okay. <clears throat> I guess we're going to do a little overtime. Yeah, we'll do a little overtime. Okay. I'm just going to leave this right here. Here we go, folks. Oof. <sighs> Does it hurt? Does uh, it feel like it's happening to you? <laughs> no, it feels good. Good. Like taking off a tight shoe. Okay. Whatever you oh, say. Um, I there think, we go. Uh, Michelle asked earlier, why do you wet the cork? Um, well, you... this one has been sitting upright like this mm -hmm. for a little while. And the cork gets dry. And corks can, you know, break off. Especially in right. like old turkey bottles. I mean, bottles. just think about dry corks. Yeah, so yeah, you kind of gets... wet it. Um, that way, you know, it, it, the, the goal is, yeah, to keep it hydrated, keep it hydrated. You're actually supposed to, if you really want to take care of your collection once a month, go and tip every bottle up. Yeah. Now that's a little that's impossible what they say. For, yeah. for us, but, uh, that ain't going to happen for yeah. us. Um, but yeah, that's, that's the goal, but also it makes for a nice cork pot. So yeah, it makes that little, uh, spittle kind of happen. I don't that word like spittle? spittle is like rick and morty like what's on rick's chin that's spittle that is spittle isn't it yeah makes a little you're in the splash zone um let's see i feel like i missed something oh 500 pizzas said uh hey when are you guys gonna do the proof down cast strength barrel proof flight you mentioned in the bourbon life podcast so yeah. we were actually talking about that today about um what flight fights next yeah we um we put that out there as a discussion again on Patreon to ask people what they think would make the most sense. And we got a lot of data and Sarah and I just need to sit down and read it all, kind of see what mm -hmm. the, the through, the, yeah. the through idea is. So it might not be the next one cause it does require some more thought and a little bit of science, a little science. Um, so we may do Ooh. something a bit easier. That's easy to drink. Mm -hmm. mm. The spice on that is nice. But yeah, it's coming soon. It's definitely on our short list of things to do. What you doing over there? I'm just getting some texts. Some texts. Okay. Well, happy shots to wrap up. Hmm. <laughs> See, doesn't listen. <laughs> um, Brent Bailey says he wants a Maryland challenge coin. Okay. State uh, your reasons. Sagamore. That's a. It's Maryland style. Right. Hey, Chad. Hi. Hi. All right, hold on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play another. Uh... Okay. Hey, Chad. Happy birthday to the fellow Taurus. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, Got to turn on the mic first. That usually works better. Hey, Chad. Happy birthday to the fellow Taurus. I hope uh, you and Sarah have a great Today, today, and uh, look forward to seeing you tonight. Uh, this is Danny of Danny's Candies. Take care. Bye bye. Danny makes some amazing candies. He does say make it. those candies, and yes. they are good. Yes. We ate all of ours. But with my mom bringing over treats, and then I made the chocolate cake, and then we got the treats from Dawn, and I'm like, whoa, we have too much dessert. <laughs> and, I, and I'm like, how am I not dessert. supposed to gain weight during quarantine when my gym's closed? Oh, how is it not supposed to happen? It's, it's already the out the window. quarantine 15. It's going to be the quarantine 15. For sure. I can't help it. What let's, am I supposed to do? Let's talk about this lot B since we opened it's it up It's very here. caramely. It is. And it got some nice spice on there. Um, I remember I think we I, had a pour of this at... Of poison ivy. <laughs> um, uh, Sutton's which is a little Italian joint uh, in our town. And we got they had a good price on this, and we got a pour of it. And obviously their bottle had been opened, and, you know, so I feel like this is going to turn into that. But mm. 
it was like super caramel. And I yeah. feel like this is on its way to that. Yeah, I think once it opens up, like it's got a really nice caramely note. Yeah. You know? I mean, I would have to, well, what's our, what's our Van Winkle vertical look like? We got the 23, the 20, the 15, this, mm -hmm. and the Rip 10. We could, we could do five. We could do five. <laughs> yeah. 10, 12, 15, 20, 23. From what I can remember about the 15, from like the limited times that I've tried it, and then also we've had the 10 before, this is where I would, between those, I'd put my money here. Hmm, wow. Well, but I we like haven't the had little that... bit of spice, it's nice, but I'm also a rye person. We haven't so. had that 20. No, but I said between the 15 and the 10 in this. Ah, okay. Yeah. The 15. The 10. The rib 10. And, and this. this. Okay. Correct. Right. 23 is just really oaky. It's real oaky. Yeah, it it's, is. It's real dark. We got another one here. We got another one. Hi, this is Shelby. And Troy Duncan. Wishing you a happy birthday. <laughs> Harmony <laughs> message. Bye. Oh, that's awesome. Chad loves the Harmony message. Love the Harmony messages. I, I do those myself. <laughs> um. Mmm. Ashley Campbell says, finish the night on Chad's favorite so far of 2020. Happy birthday again. Enjoy the birthday week. Thank you. I'd say that birthday week probably started on Thursday or Friday. Uh, why did Perry text me the word text? You okay, Perry? <laughs> Does that mean you need help? <laughs> Thank you, Ashley. Is that a safe word? I don't know. Did I not do it? Did I just do it in my mind? I think you did it in your mind. Okay, well, I'm out, so. Well, that's okay. I'll do a double. Do you want, um, do you want? Yes, you're talking to me like the dog. <laughs> do you, you want to go outside? <laughs> um, no. Would you like to do this or would you like to choose, as Ashley suggested, your, your favorite of the year so far? I can't choose for you. I would like you to have a little 23. Okay. And I'm going to have a little something else which i will reveal here in a second when you're done texting yes you just... had a text perry back text <laughs> maybe i'm just gonna say text. perry blink twice if you need help maybe he's saying i mean some people did text that number instead of call and did it come through as a text it, we got an email saying you got a text oh. um so maybe yeah. that's what he's new text what are you message. trying to say so, but again, it just lists the number, so I'm not sure who this is from. It says, happy birthday. Well, thank you, whoever. Thank you, you mystery texter. Yes. Um, text message. Trev requests that you peri pour something that's 120 proof or higher right now. <laughs> blink, <Yeah>. blink. <laughs> blink, blink. <laughs> okay. Can um, I not mess this up? Can I not? Okay, that's good. That's good. Let me see. Okay, we've it's got... Been a while. It's been a hot minute since I've had this. I mean, since we uncorked this, this is only as far as this has gotten. So it's not like this is something that we come to all the time. Mm. I mean, this is something you need to ration. <laughs> right, I mean, what, you know, who knows how long this will be around. We've got to take good care of this one. But even when we had it, I was like, yeah, this is great and stuff. Uh, would I ever pay what they pay on this crazy secondary for it? No, I think it's... I mean, it's stylish for sure, but it it's it's good quality. I mean, I'm just we're so but it's a status super, symbol. Super lucky to have been able to buy that at retail. Oh, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. It's crazy. I mean, it's crazy. It's not crazy, but you think about it. The twenty is what became like our unicorn because got that because we got last this. year. Two years, two years ago. ago. Last year was a bust. We didn't yeah, win. You're right. We went to like two or three lotteries. Well, they I didn't was even, frozen. They didn't even have it um, because I think they were waiting until warm weather and then this happened, COVID. So I think. So crazy packing total, release our coming total wine to an area near us. Soon. Never did theirs. That is so oaky. Um, I'm going to pour, this is a request, some, one of my favorites of this year. It's become the 2020 01 Booker's. This thing is a rock star. It's really good. And I'm not afraid. Who knows it? Oh, man. We're going to have to put that up against some... Ooh, if we blind that with the 30th, what if that did better? What would that mean? 
What would that even mean? What would life be? Okay, hold on. What is time? Very poor. I think that that might be a light peri pour. That's a peri pour on the light side, but a peri pour nonetheless. Perry, um, <laughs> gonna let him talk about you like that? No, I'm saying this. I know, I'm kidding. Yeah. No, that's a good uh, one. That's ooh, a good pour. I can smell the nuttiness from here. That is crazy. So you know, last oh, night, I as can't. I said, we were watching Back to the Future, one of the greatest, perfect, most perfect movies of all time. It is amazing. And we were drinking on that Booker's thirtieth, and Booker's thirtieth is amazing. But I was like. You know what? I get strong Booker's 30th vibes from that from 2020 the 2020 We agreed. Yes. Like. Smell. Like, I thought. Okay, though, but that's weird coming from this. Also, oh. <laughs> I'm all messed up right now because the coconut and so many drinks, that just smells like super musty nutty oh. right now to me. Peanut buttery. But I'm also drinking this, which is super oaky, which is, I think, like. Putting... I mean, look what we've already done. Um, We've done since a we opened this on live a few weeks ago. This I was afraid as it opened up, it was going to lose that peanut butter, it's but it been has so good. not. And people no. were saying that like, no, I've had mine open for a while, it does not lose peanut it. Peanut buttery. Um, cool sixty two Chad. Yeah. Yeah. It says happy birthday, Chad, and many more. Thank you much. Appreciate it. Four hundred and thirty five watching. Put in the coconut. Put it. Put the lime. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> put the lime in, in the, the coconut. coconut. I can't. Um, Forget how the rest goes. No, I don't know. You put the lime in the coconut. What's after that? You drink them both together. Really? I can't remember. I don't know. Um, we have a voicemail from Joseph Brazo. Oh, Joey. This, this one I do know. Happy, happy Did you do that thing? Yes. Uh, hold on. And you mix it all up. Whoops. And you mix it all up. There you go. Trev said that. He knows how to get my attention. He said it in all caps. Happy, happy birthday. And it's a special day. Happy, happy birthday is what we're here to say. Happy, happy birthday. May all your dreams come true. Happy, happy birthday for many can see you. Hey. Oh. That's great. I love it. Oh, that's that's awesome. Happy, happy birthday. Just... Sing it again. Joseph, Sing Joseph. It again. Another round. With Joseph. <laughs> Another round with Joseph. Greg I... Smith says 20 plus 20 equals 40. That's very true. Correct. Does him some good math. That is good math. Wow. Good job on the maths. I mean, um, half the time ago, you were 20. How was 20? Not as good as 40. That's what I was trying to say the other day. 30 is definitely better than 15. Woof. Woof. Would not, you could not pay me to go back. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe a million And this dollars. is a 2020. 2020 20, 20, 20, 40, boom. Did it. It's like that movie with Jim Carrey, the number 23, where he just figures, he's like, everything 23 is. 23 or 27? 23. No, number 23. I think. Twenty. Oh, Perry said, oh, 15. I think we can all agree that 15 was horrible. <laughs> Who's 15? What? Everyone. You're, when you oh, were 15. Oh, when you were 15. Okay. Everyone's like, it's, like, it's 13. 13 so hard because you're a teenager. I'm like, no, it, that's 15. Perry, half of your age, what were you doing? I want to know. Half of your age. Why are you going to pick on I'm him like that? I'm not picking on him. I'm not picking on him. I'm picking on him a little. You're picking on him a little bit. <laughs> I want to know. I want to know. <laughs> Jim Carrey in 23 and me. Adam Derry, you crack me up. That's good. He, That's he good. pops in sometimes with the little comments, and they're always so, He doesn't pop in often, but gold. when he does... They're gold. Bam. 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 Boom. Waiting. How's waiting, your Perry. baby? Waiting, Perry. I want to know how your little one is. 17. 17 again. Zach Matthew Efron. Perry. Oh, Matthew Perry. Twenty-three is the hardest age. No one likes you when you're twenty-three. Mm. Good job, Trev Wilson. You're now my favorite. Wow. Um, Perry was thirteen. He, he bought, bought a, a ticket. ticket for my crush to a John Mayer concert, <gasps> and we never and dated. And they never dated, so he bought her a concert. Did ticket you? Did you go? But 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 but. It all turned out. Perry, right? Call call into the show. Call into the show. We no, need no. we need to talk about this. No. <laughs> we need to talk. We about don't this. need to talk about it because it's nine fifteen, and we we both know that 
everything played out like it was supposed to. Because what if you had... Oh, well, absolutely. There, there's no question with that. But I want to know, this person that you bought the ticket for, did you all go to the concert? Well, you can fill us in later. No, they went to the concert. Okay. Uh-huh. Hello. No, I'm, I'm going to talk about this. Oh, Chase. <laughs> all right, there you go. There you go. Okay, all right. So this was the dumbest thing I've ever done. <laughs> ever. Well, maybe not ever. Welcome to the ever. show, Perry Ritter. Uh, th thanks, oh, yeah. Perry. Hello, hello, everybody. Thanks, thanks for calling in, Perry. Uh... Well, now everyone knows that the announcer guy's not real. Oh, no. <laughs> you've, okay, now you've blown so, it. So, so story time. Story time. So... I, I had this girl that I liked when I was 13, Aww. and um, no I had basically no money country. to my name, right? Because you're 13 years old, and, you know, that's how it goes. Sure. Um, and she made a passing comment to me about how badly she wanted to go to the John Mayer concert I I was gonna say at, the, at Rub Arena in Lexington. Aww. And I spent basically my last $100 um, to buy her one ticket so she could go without me and without anybody else accompanying it, accompanying her. Ugh, words are hard. Did she um, go home with John Mayer? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, yeah, thanks. Um, <laughs> and anyway, um, so we never dated. Um, and for about a month after it happened, um, she didn't even talk to me. Um, so that was that was also fun. Who uh, is she and where most... does she live? <laughs> no, I'm, just, uh, I'm teasing. I, I, think, I think she lives in England now. Wow. Oh, they, okay. They can have her. So she was really, <laughs> really avoiding you. <laughs> uh, uh -huh. Yeah. But no, hey, the joke's, joke's on uh, 13-year-old Perry now. I'm married and I got a kid on the way That's right. in October. So. And he can go see John Mayer with you anytime. That's right. <laughs> cheers, <laughs> cheers to Perry. And baby. Cheers to Perry's, uh, Perry's having babies. <laughs> Perry's having babies. Also, yeah, also, cheers, cheers to you, Chad. Happy birthday. I'm, I'm sorry to take over the show on this. No, I know. That was a great. Life. We needed to hear the John Mayer story. That was a great story. Thank you. Thank yeah, you for. I'll, I'll, I'll try to go in in more, uh, more detail um, sometime soon. Ooh. Anyway, all right. That's it. All right. All Thanks, right. ma'am. Goodbye. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. Happy -bye. Bye. <laughs> birthday. Thanks. We gotta get the baby Perry a little baby bear shirt. Oh, absolutely, a little little little, a little pear baby bear, bear cup. onesie, a pear bear cup onesie. Mm -hmm. Oh man, I have all the ideas. I need to write these down so I remember them tomorrow. So I gotta say, so I'm having the Pappy Van Winkle 23 year right now, and I'm like, give oh, me, we should give me back that Booker's 202001, right? Well, I I it's not fair for me to say. Because I had the Pappy 23 first, which was very nice and enjoyable. Oaky, but like as I sipped it, I mean, we're doing this in mm. what's supposed to be an hour long format. We're a little bit in overtime. That's fine. Um, so I'm not sipping on this like I normally would if it was just me and one Glen Karen of whiskey. Sure. I would take a little bit more time with it, um, but we're in kind of drinking talking mode. It was a bit different. Uh, so yeah, I went through the Pappy kind of fast and it was good i really liked it but again i like it for retail i like it for what it goes for i would i would wait in line for it sure yeah. um i would not pay twenty two hundred three three thousand what's it go for Oh, I know. You're asking the wrong person. I, I, would, I would say around... I don't even know what it goes for, because I've never looked, because I don't feel that way. 23 to 2500 Now, you know what I would pay for? I would pay... What is that? Quadruple? I would pay $1,200 for a bottle of Booker's Rye. Oh. I would <laughs> pay for that. I would pay for that. And I'm sure that there's a handful of other things that I would pay for. Like, if mm. we could get our hands on that first bottle of William Heaven Hill, like, I'd pay for that. And the Pappy is good. Don't get me wrong. I'm not knocking it. It's quality, but yes. I think it's priced right at retail. Yes. It's priced right. Just the way it is. Um, really good stuff. But going to this, where the the Pappy is just so so light, so much lighter. Yeah, and I think Even also, though it's 23 years old, this is just... It's, it's like, we know the price of this. And I know it gets some flack, actually, because the price has gone up a little bit. But um, 
you know, we got this for seventy two ninety nine, and you can walk into pretty much any liquor store, and they'll have Booker's. They might not have the Booker's that you're looking for because they might have an older one that hasn't sold yet, so they haven't gotten the new batch in or whatever. Right. So that's the the kind of iffy thing. But Booker's will pretty much be at any liquor store, and this one, this twenty twenty oh one, is legit. Oh my. <laughs> Sorry, I'm happy. It's my birthday. He's happy. It's his birthday. You didn't even giggle like that about the 30th. Well, I, I mean, th I think it's just p knowing that this is this and I'm figuring in the price and availability yeah. makes me just enjoy it. Uh, oh, we got $2 Perry for the Perry Sym Symphony. Sympathy. Sympathy fund. We're going to refund his John Mayer ticket. That's right. We're going <laughs> to do that $1,300. $1, that $100 back for 13-year-old Perry. Thank you, JG Wentworth. Oh, oh and Scott. Scott says Booker's 2001 Best Batch Ever. I don't now, know. Now that is a theme for an upcoming live episode, I think. Or a flight fight. Or but maybe a live flight fight? A live flight fight. I like that. Because we figured out we can do it on the whiskey from home. That's right. We've always debated about how well that would go before, but I think it went well. The only, um, the only problem is, is the people at home don't know what we're what we're drinking. But maybe if we had a moderator. Um, who could follow along to our switching that could then let people know in the chat. Okay. That we'd have to cover up the chat to where we couldn't see it. Okay. We'll figure some, I think there's a way in what you're saying. I, I agree. Yeah. Um, because I want to put, I want to put <laughs> this one, I want to put sip a while. I want to put kitchen table. Yeah. And maybe that one that Perry and Swan got us for our wedding. Oh, that was really good. That was really good. There's only like. But that one's not. It's not like a number, right? It's not. But it would be good to know. I think we should. We're saying like regular bookers off the shelf of all time. We should do an uncorking of the center cut because we do have a sealed bottle of we center do cut. Do have a center cut? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Perry fun. Ten dollars. <laughs> Okay, well, we Perry, have twelve dollars for Perry. Fund. Well, Perry just said compounding interest. I guess thirteen hundred. Well, yeah, okay. <laughs> we have twelve dollars. We have twelve. <laughs> we have twelve dollars, which I will put towards your baby shower. Yes, absolutely. Right? Mm. No. I mean, Booker's Bluegrass is good. Um, country ham was good. Country, beaten but biscuits was a last year hair just, better for us. Last year just did not have any rock stars for me. Right, right. Um, Brian wants to see 2020-01 versus 2018-04 to enter one leaves. It's the Thunderdome. Ooh, the Bourbon Thunderdome. I like I, I really like, like the Bourbon Thunderdome. Yeah, we got to do that episode again soon. When did we do that? It was on a live, right? It was last weekend. Yeah. <laughs> and that means it's time for us to go. Yeah, and David's saying happy birthday, Chad. One last cowbell. Thank you all so, so much. Um, Did you have a good birthday, Chad? I had a great birthday. I think that you've spent this birthday with more friends than any past birthday. And although I couldn't give you the party, all maybe it wasn't the party that you deserved, but it was the party that you needed. That's very true. That's very true. Um, I, I want to give one last... I stole that from Batman. Well, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think everyone knew that. Uh, I want to give one last salute. This is Booker's 30th. Ooh, this would be good. Yeah. Ooh, cake. Kilko, thank you for mm. reminding me about the cake. Dang. I'm going to go eat that cake. Okay, so here's... With the rest of this. Here's the thing. Booker's 30th has a complexity level. That... It, it, well, it can be tricky because the overt smack you over the face with a can of peanut butter goodness the 2001 is oh. can get in the way sure and can kind of put blinders on you but once you really dig down deep into that you know what is it a 16 year old combined with a 13 uh sorry a nine it's a 30 percent of this is a 16 year old oh. and 70 percent of this is a nine year old whereas this mm -hmm. one is all of a six year, four month, and 21 day. Um, this combination is a little bit more complex and la layered, <laughs> a lot like me. You're complex and layered? Yeah, um, everyone's saying it. And this is just like... Jose, hello. Hey, Nutty, Nutty Squad you Team Leader. It's, you showed up for Nutty. You know, it's it's a whole thing. What was it's I saying? Oh yeah. I'm sorry. 
I'm a I'm the worst. I ruined your birthday. Chad's like an onion. He's got layers, and it makes me cry. Oh, I got yeah. <laughs> I, got, I got them layers. I got them layers on lockdown. Um, Lilith. There you go. Happy quarantine right. birthday. Thank you so much. The reason that the 30th prevails is because it's so complex and rounded. And while the flavors in the 2001 are amazing, it is really directional, right? You're, you're getting like a, a swatch of mm. um, a Jim Beam flavor. Whereas I think the 30th is doing a really good job of just being like all around exceptional. Like you. See? It all, it all ties back. Uh, thank, thank you for that, love. Appreciate it much. Um, we hope to see you in September. I don't know if that's going to be possible, but I, yeah. I'm fingers crossed. Yeah. Fingers crossed. Um, want to give a, a, another big thank you uh, to you know just at, as, as we end this thing to Drew. Drew Bolin, you are the evil genius who kind of put all this into motion to get us that peppy 20 year. Um, you conspiring yeah. with Trev and Todd and Tony, uh, everyone else who gave amazing super chats and PayPal um, sending and everything. And there's going to be another bottle that gets birthed out of this uh, from Justin's House of Bourbon. We're going to go try to find Sick. something really unique. Hold your prize. And, and awesome. Hold your baby. It's right here. Here, I'll show you. Show everyone what I'll you got it. so they can take pictures. <laughs> Hold it up. You now, if I was a mom. Yeah. Uh, show everybody. No, seriously. We were we were floored by everyone's generosity. Um, I mean... The, the ones who were involved know what you gave. So obviously those persons are much appreciated. But everyone who gave is also very appreciated. And it's really like humbling and almost makes you feel like I don't deserve this. We don't deserve this because this is for both of us. Yeah. I know it's my we birthday. Talk, but but this, we talk about this a lot. Yeah. Because uh, it just feels like we're talking to two <laughs> laptops and one camera. Right. Not, you know. Got two laptops and a camera. And however many, not however many 400 and something people that yeah. were on here earlier. Yeah. Um, it doesn't feel that so way. So it's, it's very humbling, but it's uh, awesome whiskey drinkers in general generosity so we're just so so super humbled and thankful and grateful for this so a shout out to to drew and everyone who was involved in the conspiring to make this a reality to make a a dream become realized literally yeah making dreams come true yeah so cheers thank you and to jose who says Can and to jose nutty, nutty squad, squad. Happy birthday. Thank you much. Pappy 25. Yeah, the Rip, Rip Amical 25. I don't know if we'll ever have that one because that one is super expensive and super rare. I forgot about that. I've seen it. When we say complete the vertical, we don't. <laughs> we don't mean the 25 because that that's seems, crazy. That just seems unrealistic yeah. and silly. I mean, maybe one day if we want to shell out a whole bunch of money, but I don't. Yeah. I'd rather buy things that you guys can actually get that we can actually try. Right. So that's the tea. That's the t and that's the tea. <laughs> and that's the tea. Yeah. Okay. Takupa, OBC Kitchen. Yes. yes maybe yes. maybe a pour could be attainable. Did it one day? We? No, they wouldn't, because they were doing that thing. Then what? what? Right. Mm. Or my that night is a little fuzzy. They wouldn't give the double eagle. Right. Not the double eagle. Very rare. It's okay. That was a long night. <laughs> And that's why... That should have been Chad's birthday. It should have, yes. Okay. <sighs> okay. I told myself I wasn't going to cry tonight. Oh, Perry. Um, you're so sweet. Oh, I'm going to get you all the baby presents. If you'd like to donate to the Perry John Ritter Fund... John Ritter. John Ritter? <laughs> He's been gone a while, sweetie. Not John Ritter. John Mayer. Or John Ritter Memorial Fund. Uh, Three's Company. He was really good in that one episode of Buffy. And Scrubs. <gasps> Who's that? Graf's was dad. He was dad. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So if you wanna... Oh, t I'm going to steal mm. a page right out of Perry's book. Tips and bits. You got to watch or listen to Fake Doctors Real Friends, the podcast on Spotify or anywhere you want to listen to podcasts, as yes. we all know. And then we're re-watching Scrubs along with them. And they're talking about all the episodes. It's been 20 years since the first ones. Yeah. 
Can you believe? Anyways, we love Scrubs. Uh, the, fun, fun tidbit. Yes. Chad proposed to me with a Scrubs-inspired montage, uh, and we got married uh, with, you know, our, our wedding music was a couple of songs from Scrubs. So, you know, I don't know what Scrubs means to you, but it means a whole lot to us, so you respect it. That should be enough to get us on the podcast, Scrubs. right? Scrubs. Yeah, they have a podcast, and you can you can write them an email, and then you can get on the show, and, you know, we want to get on Let's the show. Let's start a letter-writing campaign to get us on there. Let's start a letter-writing campaign. <laughs> no, but they always campaign. have, like, one or two fans uh, call in or Skype in or whatever, um, Zoom in. Yeah, they Skype. And uh, they get to ask a question to Zach and Donald. And Chad wants to ask a question. We would love to uh, to do that. Sort of, sort of a, I would sit in our closet even though it's not a walk-in. Um, right. Anyways, that's that's too many details. That's enough. Right, 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 right. We've said enough. Um, now it's just the bourbon. As as Eddie Russell would say. Now you're just drinking. Now you're just drinking. Now you're just drinking. I'm too drunk to taste this. chicken. I'm too drunk to taste this chicken. All right. Cool. Ethan said, "So excited to see Chaz and Sarah with an H on Chad's <laughs> birthday. Happy XX Ith. What class?" Such class, exuding. Such class. Thank you, Ethan. Uh, here's something. I got cake to eat. Let's and go. Our, our, our peeps reminded us in the chat that we did have that 25-year uh, Van Winkle. That's what I said. Yeah. Oh, well, it was confirmed. It's corroborated. No, so. I know you said it. I know you said it. But it doesn't matter I was, when I no, say it, because that I was, doesn't make it real, because he doesn't trust I was me, fuzzy. just like the Super Chats. I was waiting for a corroboration. Corro- it was corroborated. Cor- corroboration? Yes. Uh, and it's co- it's cooperated. Corroborated. Yeah. So, you know, I just wish maybe we had a little less so I could remember it. <laughs> I agree. That was a long night. Yeah, but a great night. I remember thinking this is delicious. See, Tony's saying he should have taken notes. <sighs> what happens Chris. in Lexington stays, stays in, in Lexington. Lexington, unless we're drinking. Yes. Yes. Oh boy. All right. All right. Hey everyone, Fun thanks times. for making this a birthday to remember. One for the books. Y'all got. Thank you 90 much. 90 minutes. 92 minutes, actually. 92 minutes. It feels like 32 minutes. Well, that's what you would say. Yeah. You, do you even know where you are or what time it is? Nope. What month is it? Um, probably <laughs> May, because that's my birthday month. Y'all are setting in. No, it's nothing to joke about. I can joke about it because I know I'm going to be there one day. So, uh, it's okay. You'll still love me. It'll be just like the notebook. <laughs> just like All right, it. shut it off. <laughs> just like Ryan Gosling. All right. <laughs> Brian's wife is going to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> Brian, thank you so much. Thank everybody. Thank right. Yes. And I, that's right. More I, speeches. I, I forgot to also extend that word of thanks to Brian Gillespie for that uh, couple amazing, or three, I think, amazing super chats. Four. Four Two amazing. 20s, 100, and a, th- a th- 300. <laughs> I need to go to bed. <laughs> Mm. Thank you. <laughs> My face feels hot. All right. Um, this is us. No, we're, you can't say that. S- That's off. a show on uh, the, just, on the TV. Uh, talking into the mic. I felt like the race went real real good. Uh, the car was handling. But car was handling good. I don't know do you. I'm not sure what I should do with my hands. All right, everybody. Thanks so much. Um, we'll see you all later. Love you. Drink whiskey. Bye-bye. Love.